afternoon everybody it'll probably be morning when you see this but it's afternoon here it is currently 25 past two and we thought we would record today because we are going to do something fun where are we going renee to liverpool to the river of lights we are we're going to liverpool to the river of light oh. festival yeah can I go? Can I go? Can I go? oh wow 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 it's decided it's okay okay go on then hi well, as you've just heard, the girls have gone over into their friends. But yes, we are heading off to Liverpool River of Light. Is it the River of Lights? It is, isn't it? I, I got this wrong last year. I called it the Festival of Lights, and I think it's called the River of Lights Festival. So we went last year, we vlogged it, and still to this date, it is my most favourite vlog that we've put on the channel. One of them, anyway. I just think with the music and everything and it was a nice memory i mean you ended up really sick afterwards didn't you with your tooth you had an infection in your jaw and all that after that but um anyhow it was a really nice time aside from the next day ending up bad so we wanted to go again um apparently they change it up every year we'd only been for the first time last year hadn't we covid and everything else had stopped us from going so it was nice to go last year so we're going again this year we Head us off about four o'clock last year, didn't we? Yeah, we got there too early, but this time we're eating out while we're there, so we can probably get there for around the same time again and then go for our tea and then go out to see the illuminations when it starts. And if you don't know what the river, river of lights are, it's like a big illuminous, it's a lot. It's, it's art. art that's made around Liverpool to um, show the different creations of the creators that have created the creations of light. Each creation of light has different meanings. So the one I was reading, there was like um, sticks with a ball on, and that meant um, freedom of air and freedom of right. And so each one has meaning. So yeah, there's like information boards and that. I don't think I vlogged that last time did I? because no. I was on my old device. Well, wasn't it? So you we had like, two feet. Yeah. Just go out and get it done. Yeah, we just tried to get it done, and it started raining, and then the train but went on fire on the way home. Hopefully that won't happen. Aren't we so growly, we are going that's... to a new train station though, yeah, aren't we? I'm dead excited train. to see it. Yeah. Like it's it's in our area. The new train station's being built in like our area now. We used to have to walk thirty minutes to get to it. Yeah. This is only fifteen, so. It'll be good. So it'll be good to see what that's like. How close it is to home. How easy it's to, it it is to get to, town, yeah. to get to town. Get off the train and walk home. Yeah, that's what I mean. Yeah, because we usually have to taxi. get like six pound taxi or walk for ages, don't we? I just need to change my position in this chair because my back's killing. So yeah. Anyway, we are off there this evening, which should be fun. We're gonna eat out while we're there. The boys don't want to come with us. Like I begged them all week, haven't I? Pretty much. Um, but Matthew like gave me false hope and was like, I might, I might come with you. And the closer it's got, he's like, no. And then I asked him again this morning, why, why don't you want to come? And he said, it's going to be cold, it's going to be miserable, it's going to be boring. And the girls are just too loud when we're out. And I was like, the girls aren't that bad, aren't that bad when we're out, you know. I don't think they are. Like, I think they're really well behaved, aren't they, when we're out. And we always get comments on how well behaved they are. And he's like, no. But I think he's just in that teenage era where he doesn't want to be seen with his little sisters, you know. And um, so we, him and Zach have said they don't want to come. And I said, well, since we're eating out, do you want to get a takeaway? So him and Zach have got a night planned to, to have a takeaway, watch a movie, play Xbox. And they're just going to have fun here, aren't they? Yeah. Which is sad. I miss them being young, you know. I really do. They didn't even pack half pumpkins this year, only the girls did. Well, the two girls, the baby was asleep when we started. I did a little short on it, in fact, we didn't record it, so I put a little short up of it. It was cute, really cute. If you haven't seen it, check it out. Right now, we're just chilling down for a little bit until we have to leave. I think, is she having a nap? Yeah. She's having a nap. So she'll be right as rain later on and not trying to keep her awake until bedtime and all of that jazz. It's raining. It's raining. Oh, and the fire, yeah. We've done a couple of changes to the house since the last vlog. We We've had a pumpkins, a load of mess here on this little side table. Worst thing I ever did putting that there. But yeah. We've added a fire and a fireplace. The skating boards and all that all need repainting, but it's things that we're getting around to. Firstly, we got the fireplace, didn't we? In a thing that we were gonna get a back for it. And like, we can't have a built in fire here because we haven't got a chimney, but a fake fire and then we got this one i fitted it which is why it's slightly <laughs> over this way than it is that way but i'm really proud i did it myself did a good job but that is so good it's like i can't wait until christmas to hang all the stockings along here 
And if you've watched us for a very long time in our old house, which was two doors away, you'll remember we already had a fire surround and a fire, which we brought from our old house. And we left it there thinking we wouldn't need it. Worst thing we ever did, these houses are freezing. <laughs> so you do need it. So that throws out a lot of heat, which is nice. And it'll be lovely around Christmas when the wreath and... No, it's not a wreath, what's it called? A garland, the Christmas garland and the stockings. So that's one new thing that we've put in. And then we got this. Our first printed family of seven picture. That's from the baby's christening. So obviously we always take pictures of us and what we try to. It's never really all seven of us though, is it? Because someone's always taking the picture. But my dad actually took that picture. We've got one from Christmas where there was all seven of us and I don't think all of us were looking at the same okay. time. Must be. No, it's, it's like that. But with it... With that spaced out, that in certain angles are the are most of the picture or Joe's out of the picture. We don't all fit in. In fact, I think it might be the picture on this channel. I might change it before this video goes up now. <laughs> but um, yeah, we, it's not very often that we get a full family picture. So when we got one that we actually liked, we, we went to get printers. We've seen a, this frame in home bargain for five pounds really nice at uh, a3 isn't it so then we went down to max spielman like him hi can we get a a3 picture print and they were like yeah 14.99 and i went for a picture print she went yeah i went all right then we'll come back later i went to joe that's a lot that i'm sure for a picture print for, for a3 size anyway it's gone up a, a lot over the years I'll have a little look online. And Funky Pigeon came up trumps. How much was Funky Pigeons? Four pounds or four ninety nine? Mm. I think it comes to seven pounds twenty five with delivery, which is a bargain for like half of the price of what they wanted in the Max Spielman. So, like, always shop around, always look around and see because you know you can't get it cheaper elsewhere. And it only took. Did I order it on Wednesday evening? Yeah. It come yesterday at three o'clock in the afternoon. Was it three o'clock? Oh no, you just finished work. Yeah. Five o'clock. Came at five o'clock with Royal Mail. So it probably would have come earlier, only did a little bit hit and miss around here, the, the mailman. But yeah, I'm absolutely made up with it. It's really nice. The house is starting to look more homely now, isn't it? Yeah. So we're getting we're getting happy with it. I mean, it took us five years, but we're getting happy with it. Well, we're all ready to go. Hi. I'm scared. Joe's just putting the baby in the pram. You don't need to be scared. She's a little bit nervous of the um, new train. the new train station, aren't you? Okay. Hey? <laughs> you did, and now you've got a blue mouth. Fabulous. I didn't even know she was going to the ice cream man. She just sold some bracelets, so she had some spare money. Yeah. Maybe um, they get me something. She's got me um, eyeballs, but I didn't want. Them. Did she? Oh, that was nice of her. So yes, we are just ready to go. The boys have just been to the chip shop. Well, the boy, should I say. Matthew's just been to pick up his order. It's probably a little bit earlier than you wanted it, isn't it? Uh, right now, so but he said he wanted to wait until we were gone, but I didn't want him to be like leaving the house while we're not in the area because we're going to be like far out the area. So we made him go and get it whilst we were still close by, basically. Because if he doesn't want to, he can put it in the microwave and he's not like that. Yeah. You're just going to watch a movie, aren't you? And then um, you're going to enjoy your evening. They've been out already, you and Zach, haven't you? They got a, uh, what did you get? A cake? A, cake. a, Swiss, a Swiss roll, a lemon Swiss roll. Yeah. <laughs> Random. I thought it was strawberry. Oh, thought it was strawberry. And oh, when he got home, he was like, it was lemon. Pardon? Yeah. Lemon cake's nice, isn't it? It's refreshing. Um, especially when it's not the cake that's lemon. It's just the inside. Yeah, it's like, um, um, oh, what is it called? Lemon. What's that stuff? Lemon. Kids. Kids, yeah, that. I was thinking lemon zest, but I was like, that's not the way. Do you want a cake answer? Mm, go to Joe. Answers all the quick cake questions. They got some crisp, they got some lemon cake cake, they got some chocolate. And is that all you got? Yeah, and a chippy and some movie. Oh, two biggie crisp and all the movies that they want to watch and all the Xbox time that they want to play on. So just be good, don't be too loud. And the neighbours, I mean, they are good, I mean, they always stay in. No Instagram post for parties. What? Yeah, yeah, no parties. Almost there. Just got to go over this big bridge. Nevaeh is not in the happiest of moods at all. She didn't want to be in the pram, she doesn't want to walk, she doesn't want to do anything. <laughs> she woke up. Oh no, she woke up as a negative Nancy. <laughs> We're here, the new headbolt lane train station. Right, let's go. We're crossing on the bike crossing, even though we're not on a bike. Oh. 
yeah, Renee's a little bit frightened. Um, she doesn't like trains anyway, and then she doesn't like tall things, so she didn't like the bridge. So she's conquering two fears, as well as another Question, fear. If she doesn't because, like tall things, why is she on the top? No idea. She just doesn't like the bridge, and she doesn't like trains, and she doesn't like the train station, the new train well, station. Happy. So she's conquering Can three fears. Well, we're here, we're paid. I couldn't really record much because it's quite busy, isn't it? There's security yeah. here as well, which is strange because there isn't normally anywhere else. I thought that the train went right the way through to like um, Wigan. I thought it went right through to Wigan from here, but it doesn't, there's actually Bullard which stops it. So this is like the new Kirby station. Just like this. So why is the two platforms? So there's the new Wigan line down there. You just have to go behind that boulevard but yeah this is it and you can go over that side too but that side's not open yet is it so the, the doors open on both sides yeah because if that's right oh yeah oh wait maybe you have to go like behind that so the only negative we've found so far about this station is the trains every hour and there's no seat in areas yeah there's no there's only one seat in area <laughs> Everybody's found a seat. There's only one seat in area, but there is loads over there, which is strange, isn't it? So, um, I wonder if I don't know. But yeah, the trains are every hour um, where they used to be. It didn't used to be every 15 to 20 minutes. Yeah. I mean, we've got. I mean, if we'd have got here and wait an hour, I'd have been very disappointed. I'd have got the bus probably because it takes an hour yeah. on the bus. But the fact that we've got here and we've only got like 20 minutes to wait, it's not too bad because we're getting yeah. into town in 15 minutes. What are you doing, head button? Are you hair button? What are you doing? Say hi. Say hello. Pretty she's looking grumpy. at herself. Yeah, yeah, she's being grumpy. Yeah, Renee is a little too. emotional. Yeah. Nevaeh is a little grumpy. Nevaeh. <laughs> yeah. Are we on the train? Yeah. Where is she? Where is she? Boo! Where is she? Big a boo! We've just come to some pools. It's really busy everywhere, isn't it? Yeah, everywhere's been so busy. We walked in and out to two places. We tried to book a Chinese all you can eat and we had to book in advance. So we went to back in McDonald's, aren't we? What are you getting? Mm -hmm. I was asking for a drink. Yeah. Nevaeh is keeping herself entertained. Aren't you, baby? Everyone's happy they're eating. We just popped into Tesco to get some drinks <laughs> and then right facing was the first illumination.
Right, here's the trail wrap map. So, where's your dad? If we come out of here and go up Castle Street and around and around and around and around and around, we'll finally get to where we need to go, okay? And we'll end up back here. Okay, let's go then. We thought this was an illumination. It doesn't look like it is, does it? Hey. It is, is it? Oh, look, plants. <laughs> but no, I don't think it is. I think it's a part of their bar, look. It's raining, but we're not letting it stop us, are we, girls? No, I've got a frozen umbrella. Ebony's umbrella has collapsed. It did this last time. It did, but it was when we were on our way home, wasn't it? Guess what? We left my necklace. My necklace is like that. Yellow. He's definitely wearing blue shoes, and there's Joe with his on as well. He looks like a doorman. <laughs> It's all pink. So apparently that's not that's not a cruise ship and it's a docking station. <laughs> Cancel if you thought that um, it was a cruise ship because it definitely looks like one. I'm sure it is. It's gotta be. There's its front and there's its behind. It's definitely a ship that Joe.
I don't know if we've finished the illuminations or what, but we're heading towards a big wheel. The girls are like, I want to go on it, but we know the second that we try to go on it, they're going to say no. Yeah. What do you think? Will it be like the one in my office to get in? And I'm like, no, 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 no. Left, guys. and climb on there, it's by the water. And if I get down, oh, can you see the big wheel? Yeah. What colour? What colour? Well, we've just been to Costa, and I just got her first ever hot chocolate. Is that nice? Look at the eyes. Mm. <laughs> I finished mine in like two seconds. You did, but you can have this. Here you go. You can have my one. Bye. I've only drunk two sips out of it. I don't really like it. So, for anybody who doesn't know, baby chinos, baby hot chocolates, child hot chocolates from Costa are only 80 pence. Aren't they 60 pence? 80 pence for cream and I think it's £1.10 with a marshmallow. So absolute bargain, especially if you don't like um, drinking hot chocolate like I don't. I don't mind wasting 60 p to have a couple of sips. And I've got Joe Coke Zero. Yeah, <laughs> You've been down for a drink, haven't you? Now, I think we've just got one last light to see, which is just over here. And then we can start heading towards home. You got yourself back out, didn't you? Hey, eh? The hot chocolate got thrown. And she climbed out, we didn't even realise she was climbing out and Joe was like, what's that stopping the parameters here? We're a foot on the front wheel. We've arrived at the train station. We're all a little bit wet, aren't we? <laughs> My hair is like dry. I don't know why I bother washing it. Seriously, I washed and dried it last night and then it always rains. Oh no. We'll just have to give it um, a quick brush when we get in. And um, blast it with the air dryer and then get a shower tomorrow. Me scared. So the reason I'm scared of is because the last show because the last time there's paper on the train, on the train running over that, and it, and it went on fire, and then it burned up the fire, it was all smoky. Yeah, there was about a loud bang, was, wasn't there? Yeah, and I was really scared. That was, a, that was the yes, other train then, station. Yes, no, that was Moorfields. Moorfields, yeah. And this is Central, and the What's guy then? told you 
the guy told you, didn't he? He said it's a once, it's a once in a lifetime thing. It doesn't ever happen. Yeah. So it, it won't happen here. Because I was crying. So the guy wants the once in a lifetime thing. So it, it's the won't ever happen again. Yeah, that's why you're a little bit frightened. But you've always been a little bit frightened of trains anyway, haven't you? But I've we don't need to be. So how many fears have we conquered today? Ten. Four. Four. Five. Because yeah. we did the new station, the bridge, the train, and the lift. The lift, the lift that we went in in yeah. McDonald's. Yeah. You conquered your fears. Okay, it's just taken off now. <laughs> so something that I never knew could happen. <laughs> Someone keeps coming over the game, voice Tanoi, and she's saying, "Stand over the yellow line," and then she's pointing people out. The guy in the checkered shirt, the man holding the chippy, the girl in the green dress. And then she's she's saying, "I'm the girl in the green top." Thank you. Thanks. I oh, want yeah. your job. Yeah. Oh. Oh, she didn't say anything this time. I mean, we're laughing about it like it's funny, but it's serious, isn't it? Like she's letting them know because there has been a couple of like train and people incidents recently, like not just the air everywhere, so. The fact well, that she's actually no, doing that is, is nice, you know. She's warning them to stay back and keeping them safe. Yeah, keeping them drunk. safe. Yeah, keeping them safe while keeping it funny and happy. Yeah. So our train was just here, called, and now it's cancelled. Fantastic, absolutely fabulous. So we've ended up getting on a different train, getting off a cake tail and waiting here just to get out to that train station because it was getting a little bit busy. But now it's busy. <laughs> And one saying delayed, not cancelled, and the other one saying it's coming at quarter to ten. By the time we get home, it's going to be past ten o'clock now. <laughs> Baby. I'm like freezing. She's really tired, like she's ready for bed. Hopefully she doesn't like try and take a little nap and then I can just like do a bum and convert her to bed after I've put her in some pyjamas. And you're freezing, aren't you? So, freezing cold, put your hood up as bad. Are you not that cold? <laughs> Why are we dancing? This one wasn't cancelled, was it? <laughs> Certainly knows how to keep them warm in this cold weather. Turn the lights off. Oh, you're joking, you're lying. No, no. You're lying. It's gone. Back at the back at the depot. Oh, we've just got off the train and now we're heading home. It's like a fifteen. 20-ish minute walk it's teeming it's gone 10 o'clock let's get us home we saw granddad's brother and he looked just like granddad and i think the very thought he was granddad <laughs> she was very friendly with him and she was only very friendly with my dad so i think she did think i haven't seen him for ages since I way like before them. the pandemic he's funny. he's funny i like them <laughs> i think the last time i seen him was um Yes. On my auntie's funeral, the last time I seen my uncle, so it was nice to see him. The very trying to climb out the pram, so I'm gonna go and I'll catch up with you when we get home. Well, we're now home. It took us 25 minutes. It's meant to be a 15 minute walk. It wasn't quite that. The baby did end up getting out, which probably took an extra five or so minutes. But um, yeah, we're home. Thankfully, it's rained non-stop for the past couple of hours so we are drowned as rats the girls are just upstairs getting dry i've told them not to bother getting a shower tonight just try and dry the hair off as much as they can and get into some pajamas and then get into bed because it is now 10 35 so it's a bit late i've got to edit this video and have it up tomorrow as well the lights were nice they were really nice i'd say last year's were better it's a kind of a little bit of a letdown because we were expecting it to be better than last year if that makes sense it was still really nice to go and it was still really nice to have the experience and see the looks on the kids faces so i suppose from a, a child's perspective it was amazing like they just keep talking non-stop about the night they just run upstairs telling you all excitedly didn't they mainly so, about the train yeah they, mainly about the woman in the train station shouting to people over the microphone but um, yeah, they've had a really lovely evening, all of them, even the baby, seeing their little face light up with all of the lights. And hopefully this time next year, I shall be driving so we can drive this. We haven't got to do all this train palaver and getting soaking. I mean, we'll still get soaking, but not 
as Sohan. So yeah, um, I'm going to say bye now because I've got to try and get this edited tonight. So I hope you enjoyed it and thank you for watching. Give us a huge thumbs up, subscribe and click the notification bell. We upload new videos every Tuesday, Thursday and Sunday with a short every day that we don't upload a long video, if that makes sense. See you again soon. Bye. Six little